So VN96, in collaboration with the Atlanta Cancer Research Institute, is uh, a peptide that we co-invented and designed with them. And it specifically, it binds to um, uh, little cargo transports called exosomes. And exosomes are important because exosomes are secreted when there is uh, uh, cell damage or cell stress. And so if you think about doing a liquid biopsy, what you can do, and, and exosomes are released from the cells and they circulate through our blood system in urine, saliva, um, and in your blood. And so we invented a peptide that can separate these exosomes. So the interesting thing is we can do a liquid biopsy where we take a blood sample or a urine sample, we add our peptide to the cocktail, we mix it, it binds to these, and then we can, through filtration, we can separate these exosomes. And since the exosomes came from diseased cells, we can then do downstream um, uh, processing of the proteins and the DNA on the exosomes to figure out different disease states. Now that's down the line, you know, our peptide basically, it's just an isolation methodology for isolating exosomes, which have all this material on them. And so um, it's a product we've been working on for about five years now, it's working well. We have the me kit, microvesicle, which is another word for exosome. A microvesicle iso, um, enrichment kit, the me kit, um, and it's selling well to researchers worldwide, but now we're currently looking for a strategic partner to get it into hardcore diagnostics. Um, and so, you know, we'll do the isolation, they'll do a thousand samples a day, process them, and, and we'll see if we can figure out uh, early detection of disease is what it's really all about. Well, you know, first you really need a lot of local support. So your, your local governments, you know, it starts with the federal government and, you know, right now Canada, the Canadian federal government is, is very helpful, but also with our federal government and our state government and our local government, uh, all the way down the line, uh, these funding incentives that um, are critical to these new programs because, you know, we know we have a technology and, again, we're a manufacturing facility that has now spun out um, a research facility. And so, uh, you know, that, those infrastructure needs, we're, we're redesigning a building now, another additional 10,000 square feet. So any type of TIFs, incentives that the government can give us, uh, uh, along with grants, is a big deal, along with the local support, you know, from the mayor, et cetera. Um, and so, uh, you know, that's a huge help, certainly.